Hello guys, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Saan man kayo ng lupalo ng mundo? Hello, hello, hello. So, for today's video, ang gagawin ko ay i-share ko yung process ng PNC visa namin before. So, may tanong dito, yung one of our sister, tinanong niya ako, sis, ask ko lang gaano katagal ma-process ng PNC visa. So, sis, yung PNC, pag PNC visa, ano, After nang makafile yung fiancé natin ng ganito, yung tinatawag natin ay I-129 form of F. Ano, wait ka nang may receipt sila na ibibigay sa iyo, sa inyong dalawa, doon sa fiancé mo. Ibigay sila ng notice of action 1, NOVA 1, that, that is notice na nareceive nila yung application natin. Um, and then next, ano, wait ka, and, uh, in our case, my husband pa filed our application May 2017 uh, May 2017 at saka nag-approve siya ng January na so it takes time yung approval depende yun sa kung where yung ano yung field office na inapplyan nyo maybe we California yung inapplyan ng husband ko noon because he is living here in Texas so this is the form of I-129 yan ang form so hindi tayo ang mag-fill out niyan yung husband natin ang mag-fill out. So, after after yung, ano, na-file na yun, wait, like, for, yung iba, ma ma mabilis lang na-approve yung application nila ng, ano, na, na PNC visa. Mabilis lang for, it takes like, 4 months to 10 months. Yung iba, 1 year. Yung sa amin, matagal kasi, ano, during that time, 2018, rough yung, ano, yung transition ng, 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 kasi si ano noon si si Sir Trump yung ano bagong naupo na presidente. So, yung transition yeah, affected lahat ng ano ng ng system, no. Uh, kasali kami doon, ano. Matagal-tagal din kami na uprobahan. So, after that, naka kami ng after like May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December, January. It's like 8 months hmm. from the date uh, my husband filed this one. So, it's like 8 months before kami na uprobahan. Ito po yung ano yung notice of action to which is nag ano nag inform sa amin na we are qualified we are approved approve yung application namin so after na na aprubahan kayo so it is the journey will begin the real journey will begin so start ka na ng gather ng kasi magpapadala sila ng ng steps ng tips no yung yung checklist may ano sila ako may ano ko maginawa ko dito yung checklist ko Aside from this, may checklist sila. Hindi ko nga lang nahanap dun sa folder ko. Ito lang yung ano. Pati ito ang pinaka-importante sa lahat. So, huwag kayong ito daw sa baguhan bago kayong nag-ano. On the process pa kayo. Search lang ng search guys. Kasi marami namang mga Pinay o oh, oh, ano na nagsishare ng knowledge nila about their journey. So, ano, tulungan, magtulungan kayo ng, ng fiancé nyo or yung husband mo. Huwag nyo pabiyaan yung husband nyo. So, yung ano, expensive talaga guys, especially me, galing ako ng province. So, yung, yung fare tickets ng airplane, paghandaan yun, yung food, paghandaan nyo yun, yung travel ng lahat-lahat guys, ano, uh, yung fare, like, airplane, airplane is so expensive, pag abot pa kayo ng Manila, yung taxi, whatever, because, no, baguhan tayo, hindi tayo, for those who, who's living in the province, so, for those who's living in Manila, ano na yun, alam na nila yung pasikot-sikot sa Manila. So, I'm blessed during my time because uh, my my best friend is helping me and my cousin and his wife, uh, my best friend Shirley and his her husband is helping me, David. The family Asuncion is helping me. Free yung, ano ko, free yung stay ko sa Manila. I was stayed in in Makati. So, yung yung cousin ko naman na si Ricky at saka yung wife niya na si Linley nag, ano, nag-offer sila ng help sa akin. So, I am blessed. Saka yung husband ng kasi taga Manila yung husband ng best friend ko. So, he is helping me. He is always being, ano, andun palagi si David na nag-guide sa akin. Kasi may business sila ng best friend ko na no, laundry business. So, my best friend cannot, cannot go with me because she is taking care of the bis of their business. So, yung husband niya yung nag-ano sa akin na nag-guide sa akin through and through. From St. Luke to uh, US Embassy and the CFO. So, I am thankful to God nga na pinoprovide niya sa akin yun sila. Then I am forever be thankful for them and I and I appreciate all of their efforts and I, I will be forever thankful sa sa pagmamahal nila sa akin ganun ganun. So uh, for those nga na walang kilala sa Manila, ano? 
prepare your your what we call this prepare ka ng prepare kayo ng ng yung hotel no mahal yung hotel one plus yun one thousand plus yun yung hotel yung fare yung food so I stayed in Manila like one month uh, one month plus before ko na ano before ko uh, after uh, yung process whole process na yung Saint Luke yung US Embassy uh, process at saka yung CFO. Kasi it, take, it takes time yun guys. Ano, my registration. So, i-register ka sa St. Luke. Registered ka sa, mag-registered ka ng, ka ng sa US Embassy. Yung, yung appointment. Sa, at saka sa CFO mag-appointment kayo. Oo. Yan. So, I will, I will give you some, some checklist during my time. But there is new, ano kayo, research kayo ng research guy. Huwag kayo nakadala. Yan. Yeah. Yan. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, ito po si baby Erica. So, at uh, T1 visa interview checklist. Ito po yung nagawa ko before ito yung guide ko. So, online forms like DS-160, uh, DS-160 printed confirmation page. So, handa, ihanda nyo to. Search kayo ng, ng DS-160 printed, uh, DS-160 form. Paano ba yung gagaw gagawin? So, meron tayong ano, mga guide sa YouTube. Search lang kayo ng search guys, ano, para malaman nyo yung pasikot-sikot, yung checklist, yung paano ba gawin, ganun. Huwag nyo iasa lahat sa fiancé nyo, kasi marami silang pinagdaanan dito sa US, guys, ano, ano, they are working, so, the, the living here is, yeah, it's hard, because they cannot move without their car, so, ano, malayo yung itatravel nila, it's not easy, guys, so, So, here's the number one is online forms like DS-160. So, DS-160 is like your, it, it is your uh, bio data. It's like bio data. It's all about you. And you it, it's, it, 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 it is all about you. Everything is all about you. So, search kayo noon. So, I can't provide you now because I don't have laptops. Yeah. It is it is in the, so, mas, mas maigi, ano, sa, sa computer talaga, ano. Saka, ano, sa, sa, sa YouTube din, mayroong nag, ano, noon na provide ng information how to pre, how to do it for steps uh, like until uh, the last uh, step so the affidavit of support so affidavit of support like one form one three one three four so yun ang sa fiancé visa one three four original sign in black ink number two form ten forty federal income tax return most recent years so confirmation of employment so prepare kayo nito guys so three months worth of pay pay stub Or like sleep, uh, sleeps, peace stub sleeps, uh, W2, like that, is affidavit, of, that is the, the in, affidavit of support. So, official documents, both, both, lang sa fiancé mo at sa sayo, like passport, valid for more than six months. And this over certificate, sa, sa, sa inyong dalawa to, sinumar, wala, wala sila dito sa US, walang sinumar. Ano, sa, 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 prepare yung fiancé ng galing sa Pilipinas or galing sa, from your, from their countries, uh, prepare in BI clearance. So, and then the next one is evidence of relationship like forms and cover letter one I-129, photos together, copy of our line, tickets, boarding pass, foreign travel receipt, emails, postcards, and chat logs, and engagement ring. So, yeah. Daddy, we're making videos. Someone is someone is asking me about our, our process, so I, I give them uh, yeah. some some uh, uh, knowledge, a little bit of knowledge. I see. You want you want the beauty? Come on. No. <laughs> you have mission soon. You have a mission soon, Daddy. A mission? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You, you will tell the. Yeah. Yay! Yeah, young husband to walk on now. Pagayo. <laughs> I will upload this one to the lady. Okay. Okay. So that's right. it for today. So I will make a list for all of this in the description box. So you have guide uh, through your process. So uh, God bless you guys. So the process is not easy for those uh, uh, appointment. You will grab the the schedule because ano pabilisan siya guys. So you need to hurry in getting the appointment because there are so many people who, who is uh, 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 taking its uh, uh, appointment date, date. So you have to be careful. You have to be alert in doing all those steps. Research kayo guys. Huwag kayong ano, huwag kayong ma mag makampan, diba? Mm -mm. So yung lahat-lahat na yung expenses like uh, the expenses like the uh, the airplane take it so it is very expensive guys during our time 
Uh, so, uh, mas lalo na ngayon. So, it's hard, yeah. So, during my time from Negros Oriental to from Dumaguete to Manila, so, it's like the fare going to Manila is like 7,000. Sa ano lang yun, one way lang yun, guys. So, so it is expensive. Yung yung payment ng ano, kasi increase ng increase every year yung yung payment ng yung fee ng med, uh, St. Luke Medical uh, before is like 17,000. I don't know the recent, uh, hindi ko pa na research uh, this year. So, maybe nag-increase na din sila. So, I don't know yet. So, saka yung sa US Embassy ng ano, ng visa. Di, during my time, 14 plus yung ano. I don't know the recent, uh, the recent this year. Kasi pa-change-change sila guys every year. Nag-change yung, yung rate ng ano, ng visa. Ng visa fee. Ng, ng, I think CFO is, is like 400 pesos. So, magaan yung ano sa CFO. Pero, yung CFO guys, pinaka-importante yun. Kasi if you don't have that, hindi, ka, hindi kayo makalipad going here in the US, so you cannot have, you cannot, eh, ano, yung, yung CFO, pinaka last steps, after yung, ano, yung, yung medical, next, uh, after yung medical, uh, you, uh, yung interview sa US Embassy, last steps yung, ano, yung CFO. So, yun guys, I hope nakatulong yung, yung video ko na to sa inyo. So, if you have more questions, you can comment down below. So, uh, I will try my best to, to do my best to answer so based on my experience so so guys it, magbabaya na kami ng bibi ko yo ano so my name is bibi Erika Jean so god bless you guys and good luck to all of you and to to me also because we have our upcoming interview for our adjustment status next month so god bless us all for the rest of our life bye bye